Shipments of compressed waste from Jeju have been found in Gwangyang port of South Cholla province, in addition to ports in Kunsan and the Philippines. However, a considerable amount of compressed waste is still missing. The governor and the Jeju city mayor apologize for the compressed waste disposal operations, but islanders are still disappointed. Joseph Kim reports. 42,000 tons of compressed trash generated in Jeju have been carried out of the island since April 2015. 1,800 tons of garbage were sent to the Philippines, and 8,600 tons were sent to Kunsan Port in Jala Province. Another 600 tons of trash has recently been found in Gwangyang Port in an additional inspection. But 5,000 tons of trash are still missing. Governor Won Hee Ryong and the Jeju City Mayor Go Hee Bum officially apologized for the trash disposal operation. They acknowledged that they were not devoted to their roles to supervise the trash disposal. The province says companies will be thoroughly investigated by the provincial office and its audit committee to identify their waste disposal operations and that legal action should be taken if any unlawful activity is found. One also acknowledges that substandard cube fuel of compressed trash is the root of the issue. Therefore, he says his office will thoroughly inspect waste compression companies and correct improper operations. The province has established a rule. It will dispose of 100% of household garbage generated here on the island. The province's improper trash treatment operations are a disgrace to the island. Apologies were made somewhat late. The public's distrust in the trash policies don't appear to be improving. Joseph Kim, KCTV.